ever wondered, if Lego didn't make the Lego movie, would the company still be the same? Or what if Lego never did licensing? Would we would we ever get as many sets as we did? Or would Lego would be still as popular as today? Well, we're gonna be answering those questions in a brand new series called What If? This is kind of be like a spin-off show or like just just like answering questions or just what would happen if this didn't happen in Lego? Or like, what if Bionicle was never created? What would happen? Would we ever get Ninjago or old TV shows or anything? But yeah. But with the What If series, we'll just it'll kind of be like a podcast slash discussion episode of like, what if this didn't, what if this outcome played out and would it change the Lego group? In most cases, yes, it probably would. Like in Lego Movie, it would it would be detrimental because if you um, know the Lego Movie actually like kind of revived Lego as a whole. So yeah, if the Lego Movie wasn't there. Um, I'm sure we wouldn't get half the sets, or a lot of stuff wouldn't happen. But yeah, in this discussion post, we'll have some guests on. It maybe just be me sometimes, but. Maybe up a special guest or something, maybe like J4 or something, or Penguin Bricks. But yeah, that's pretty much it. And we'll go into the sort of history of the theme or just that. But yeah, we're going to be starting a new What If series very soon. So yes, this is going to be, yeah, it'll just come out very soon. But yeah, this is Otter Bricks and Films. Bye bye